So I'm at Starbucks trying to get my coffee to start out my day and the line is extra long and moving like rather slow but it will be worth it all right so i'm at whole foods market i'm going to run in to get some keto items but i figured i'll bring you guys with me so we can see what other keto goodies they have in there so let's go I tried these fat snacks cookies once in a keto meetup that I went to. They gave us one of these cookies in the bag and they were actually good. And they're on sale two for five or two for 450 if you're a member. So I'm gonna pick up two of these. Uh, they also have smart sweets here. I have not tried these yet, surprisingly. And they have different um, flavors here. They have the sweet fish, peach rings. If I was gonna try one, it would be the peach ring. If they have smaller bags, I'll buy one. But I heard it's not great for your insulin. And these are the flavors they have of the Smart Sweets. As a gum eater, I know that this would be a better option of gum chewing in terms of watching your sugar while you're eating gum. And let's look at the macros. So you see, these are sweetened with xylitol instead of aspartame. So that's better. And they still come with two grams of carbs per stick, so. So remember I said if I was going to buy one of these, I said I would get the peach rings, right? If you look at um, the macros on this, it's 33 grams of carbs and 28 grams of fiber. Even though we calculate net carbs, that's still way too much fiber to be taking in at one time just for 10 pieces of um, candy and the carbs are too high. So yes, we do net carbs, but this is a little extreme, so I'm not going to buy it. <laughs> So I've been wanting to try these um, peanut butter cups and they're on sale. That's great for me. So I'm gonna get the dark chocolate ones. But I see another brand here, um, Evolved Keto Cups, but the price is like crazy. But um, if you look at the ingredients for these Evolved Keto Cups, it's really clean. Almonds, cacao, Jerusalem artichoke fiber, cacao butter, monk fruit, MCT oil. That's really clean. The price is just a little crazy. And it's only two grams of carbs per cup. This is like Lily's heaven. They have all of the Lily's bars. That crispy rice one might be calling my name. We shall see. So I haven't heard anybody speaking about these dang bars, but this caught my attention. They have five grams of net carbs. And let's look at a flavor that I might buy. Um, the chocolate. The ingredients are almonds, chicory root fiber, pea protein crisp, um, sunflower seeds, chia seeds, sea salt. I'm not seeing anything that's concerning and it's sweetened with stevia. So it looks like the chicory root and the stevia are what's sweetening it. So I'm gonna give it a try. This Lakanto cookie mix looks interesting. I usually make my own baked goods, but let's look at the macros on it. So for half of this mix, you get um, 11 grams of carbs, five grams of fiber, five sugar alcohol. So that's one gram of net carbs for half of this mix and this would make some sugar cookies and the price for this bag is about eight dollars so it is keto friendly but um i don't know if i'm gonna try it the swerve is on sale here and it's actually way cheaper than walmart um, for, at Walmart you would get it for the $8, but it's on sale here for $5.75 each, and that's really, really good.
So I've been hearing about these Swerve Sweets um, chocolate cake mix, and this is on sale as well. And I think I'm going to try it. Yes, I make my own baked desserts, but I think this one is worth trying. They also have the chocolate chips from the Lilies, and they have the dark chocolate, semi-sweet, milk chocolate. Just so many options here. And they're on sale, blue. So they have all of these coconut milks. This is really good, but I'm, I'm more interested in coconut cream because that's what I use in a lot of my um, baking and cooking and stuff, but I have to make sure it doesn't have any sugar. And it says it here, unsweetened coconut milk, unsweetened coconut cream. So that's exactly what I need. That there, the carbohydrates is less than one gram, no added sugars. That's how you want to get your coconut cream. I told you guys that I love cashew milk but another type of milk that I really really love is milkadamia milk and they have it here the unsweetened vanilla so I'm going to get a box of that milkadamia macadamia milk sorry and um, cashew milk those are great alternatives to um, almond milk and they taste really good you guys know I love the nut pods um, creamers and I've been seeing people with pumpkin spice flavors, all these new flavors, but I'm not seeing it here. I was hoping to see it here, but I'm gonna check the refrigerator section. But yeah, they have a great stock here of nut pods, but I wanna see those exotic flavors I'm seeing other people with, but these taste really good. So one thing I haven't um, got a lock on yet is keto cereal, and they have here the Catalina Crunch cereal. And I think I'm gonna either try the fruity one or the dark chocolate, ooh, or the cinnamon um, toast. But yeah, zero grams of sugar. We're definitely going to check the back for the, um, the macros, but I'm very excited to find some keto cereal here. And it's on sale, bloop. I picked up the dark chocolate one. It says here 11 grams of protein, nine grams of fiber. Let's check the macros. So it's 14 grams of carbs, nine grams of fiber. Um, so that leaves us with five grams net carbs for half a cup. I'll work with it. This is, this is not bad at all. So I'm excited to try this. So I'm either going to try the chocolate or the cinnamon. Which would you guys try? have organic meatballs here I know one of our concerns with our meatballs is that um, they're not made with organic meat so this might be a good option along the lines of organic meat they also have organic ground bison and they also have organic ground beef so that's also a good option. I've been having a hard time finding enlightened ice creams and I'm so happy to find it here and they have a nice little selection I think I'm gonna try the peanut butter cookie and brownie dough that looks really different so I'm gonna try that so excited now let's look at these macros you have 13 grams of carbs 3 grams of fiber sugar alcohol 9 so 9 and 3 is 12 so that's 1 gram of carbs per well, there's four servings in here, so this whole thing is four grams of carbs, which is really not bad. Does it? Ooh, I have to get another container. I can't wait to take this home and compare it to the Rebel Ice Cream and see which one passed the taste test. Ooh. I 
told you guys that I like the nut pod creamers, but they have the milkadamia unsweetened creamer here and it's on sale. So I think I'm gonna try it and I'll let you guys know how it tastes. Okay, so we're finally finished at Whole Foods. I found out at the cash register that if you're an Amazon Prime member, they can scan a code from your app, from your Amazon Prime app, and then you get a discount off of your total, especially the um, the things that are on sale. You get an additional percentage off. So I saved quite a bit of money at the cash register. So that was my little keto Whole Food Markets haul. I hope it was helpful for you guys. I was very happy with the things that I found. So that's about it.